Okay. Yeah, that's good. Bowling. Pinch of tail in the rope. Done. That's the way. I agree. I concur. Did he say we were live? Right now. Right now? Right this second. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Bike Man for You show. With a special edition, a special episode. Uh, unbelievable. We are anxiously awaiting. You can't say it. I know. It's not politically correct to be calling these guys the Nanook brothers. And we're very or sorry. Nanook, and we're very sorry because, number one, Nanook is an Eskimo. And number two, there's no Eskimos in Iceland. And we don't know. There, 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 there might be one. We yeah. weren't quite sure if it was for it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and that's right. And these guys are Eskimos that are going to Iceland. So At least that. Technically, we're not wrong, but we're not going to. But again, you know, I don't want to necessarily be name calling. Or, you know, I, I mean, like I, 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 I don't want to get anybody upset. Racial. You know, I've been, I've been told by the, you know, some of my producers and my, 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 my upper enchilant, you know, the guys that are pulling the strings and paying the bills. You know, those, the, the, the sponsor guy, I, I don't want to be pulling low tiger. I want to be like, you know, I want to keep my sponsors and whatnot. So we're not going to use the word Nanook. We're not going to Nanook them. We're going to. So if I offended anybody, I'm sorry. What can I tell you? Uh, I do not have a, mic, a, uh, a computer out here, so I've got to get going on that ASAP. We need a computer over here. Um, BMX boy, we forgot all about the computer. And we don't even know who's out here yet. So, who's on? And if they're on. And we're kind of waiting and hesitating a little. And we're going to start drawing it out. But I got some content. I've been ready. I've been ready. Uh, Thursday afternoon. I've been ready for a little content. We got a little bike in the box over here. We got a couple of bikes in the box, as you can see. <laughs> Today was delivery day. We got Sebastian is in the house. What's the word today? A lot of work. Life is good. Life is good. Work, work, work. Today's show is presented by EVT. Today's special episode is brought to you by EVT, Efficient Pedal Tools. Those guys are awesome. They make the medieval pedal wrench, which we're going to be using on these guys to get their pedals off awesome product. They also make our three-in-one air inflator as well as our third hand repair stand and they are the original manufacturers and creators of the EVT Safe Zone Helmet Mirror. So go over there and check them out if you need to. Come on over. Today's show is also sponsored by BikeManForYou.com. BikeManForYou.com has all of your needs and things and goodies for you to go on your special trip. Uh, so go over and check us out at bikemanforyou.com. We sell our shirts and our t-shirts and our sweatshirts. So if you really like the old one less car shirt, by all means, bring it on home. We got Freddie in the house. He's over here on a little separate project. He'll be coming around, I'm sure, real soon. Right? Uh, he's over here messing around with some stuff. Where are the, are, the, are the Iceland brothers? Oh, they're coming. I'll guarantee you they're coming. They're coming. All right, so Marco's getting the computer. BMX boy getting the computer. We got that. We got that. So the other day, ding, 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 ring, ring, ring. You put bicycles together. Oh, sure. Oh, sure, we put bicycles together. You put bicycles together from other places? Yeah, absolutely. We put. There's Freddy. See, he's back in the house. There he is. Freddy's in. Oh, yeah. yeah. I need a knife over here. Here we go. Knife. Yeah, we can put that together too. Good morning. How are you? You need one of those? Oh, that made a hell of a kaboom. That's, not, that's no good. What do you got? What's that? 700? Uh, 3540. Great name of Nine bucks, my friend. Pack and go. Can I pay a credit card? Sure. On the side, we'll write you up. 
Wow, there's actually How much do you want for the uh, counter? Put a bit on there. How much do I want for it? Yeah. It's for rent. Oh, the rent? Yeah, it's a rental. Big money. 48. That bike's big money. Wow. Okay. We got Tony Joe in the house, working hard. Hey. hey. We got Wiggles in the house. That's a little better. 977. Yeah. Hang on, hang on. Let me get it out of here first. Give me a little sign on that one, so right on the bottom of that. There you go, and that way, there you go. That and that and that is yours. That that is yours. You're on. Enjoy. Have fun. Ride safe. Uh, Don't forget you too. Yeah. <laughs> You're up. You got me going? Yeah, you're all set. We got all kinds of good guys on there. Got 57 so, watchers. How much? 57 watchers. Really? Already? Good. This. Goodness gracious. Everybody was just dying to see that come oh, up. Huh? I'm just checking the. Uh, Bring it on home. Just checking the comments real quick. All right. So, anyway, you got calls up on the phone. Ring, 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 ring. Blah, blah, blah. I got a bike. I want you to put it together. I'm going to ship it to you. And he picked my brain. What do you think? Blah, blah, blah. What do you think about this? What do you think about that? He says, Price Club's got a bike. I'm like, uh oh. Price Club's got a bike made by Giant, supposedly. Now, I don't know if this is made by Giant or not. It doesn't look like it's coming from the same Chinese factories that most of some of my bikes come from. Because sometimes you can tell by the labeling on it. So I'm not sure if it really is made by Giant or not, but it's a fat tire bike. It fits most riders from 5.7 to 6.2. It's a North Rock, who knows, built to be better, blah, blah. It is coming from Price Club, supposedly, and we're going to open it up right now. Came UPS. <coughs> Any suggestions for a three by and adding a dropper post? I'm not too familiar with dropper posts. I'm not familiar with dropper posts either. Oh, uh, we just don't. The, you, you know what, what the, the purpose of a dropper post is, right? You I hit do. the button and yeah. it falls and, it down, so that way when you get going down those rocket speed hills, which we have so not. Seat smack. Yeah. It's yeah. Yeah. No, you're gonna get a little yeah. bit bottom. Uh, you're gonna lower the center of gravity, all of the above. Where does the three by crank have to do with the uh, dropper post? What does the three by crank have to do with the prop that's dropper he, post? That's what he, he I keep it. Uh, what do you mean? He says. Is it a joke? I don't know. Gentlemen, maybe. what's going on? Yeah. I didn't meet you yet. Yeah, I was in college. <laughs> yeah, we just got back. Oh, how are we going? You guys' bikes are all done already. Yeah, our, our bikes are already. All right, and you're ready to go. Yeah. What's I'm, your first name? I'm Dan. And. Leland. Dan and Leland, turn around and make sure you say hello to everybody out there. These okay. are the other two Nanooks, that, I mean, two guys that are going <laughs> to Iceland. I can't use Nanook anymore because I got, I got told to by, my, by, by, by producers that uh, I'm not allowed to. But I'm not allowed to use Nanook because there's no Eskimos in Iceland, you know what I mean? So that's where I'm at. And of course, everybody remembers Nick. Nick, what's going on? Good to see you, my man. So are you guys ready to go or what? Yeah, we're ready. We're ready. You guys are ready, but these guys ain't. Where's our other victim? Is, uh, Sam is coming as we speak. <laughs> Sam is coming as we speak. So we're going to put these things in a box. The way I got this thing planned out is the BMX boy is going to do one and I'm going to do the other. And you guys can look at each other and find out and ask questions and all of the above. We are streaming live right now with approximately 100 people watching us in any specific yeah. second. Sounds cool. Yeah. All right. All right. So now those bags on the back, that's what you're going to be using. Is that what I'm hearing? Those are blasts from the past, baby. Old Cannondale bags. They should work all right. You got it down. What's that? Good price. Good price. Good price. Free? 
Uh, no, not that good of a problem. Oh, <laughs> all right. So we're not going to worry about that quite yet, all right? Okay. So we're going to keep that to the side. I just want to pull this bike out of here before, while we're kind of waiting around for what's his name. I, I kind of had other content just in case you guys were going to be late and I had a, a, a d disaster of a deal. I want to look at what this thing looks like. What do you think about one of these, huh? You guys thinking about one of these? That is some big tires, huh? All right, get out of the way of the camera, boys. Go stand someplace over there. All right, there you go. All right, so the guy bought it on Price Club. So how the heck do we survive? How do we survive when we're not selling bicycles, of course, blah, blah, blah. First off, this bike came UPS. I can't believe it came UPS. For me to get one of these boxes UPS from wherever it may be, it's cost us an arm and a leg. This thing is an oversized box. They must be having some sort of a deal going on. There is no paperwork inside of the box at all. I have no idea where it came from, uh, but I am on the, uh, on the idea that it is from Price Club. He said it was manufactured by Giant. I don't see it. We're going to have to start to think about getting it together. It's a standard Altus, not a bad derailleur, mechanical, disc brakes, got the fat top, Kenda, 26.4.0. Uh, He's hoping this thing's going to go on the beach. This ought to be interesting. We shall find out. What are you thinking about that BMX boy? $250, $300 to your door. Somebody maybe, one of you guys, could you check this out for us? Our show would not be half as fun if it wasn't for all of you guys. All of you guys that tune in and help us out and make that show as interactive and raw reality as it possibly can be. So thanks again, guys, for tuning in. Um, what's the name of it again? North Rock. Built better. NorthRockCycBikes.com. There you go. Check that out for us if you could. And it is called the what? Nice. BMX boy is always ready. XC00. XC00. So how much does that thing cost? If you guys could check us out, because he's paying $100 for us to put it together. Maybe we're too cheap. That's what I'm thinking. How the hell do we stay in business when we got stuff coming through? All right, bring it. We got a whole bunch of people in there, huh? We got Chris Reed in the house. We got Michael Fabian. We got Vincent. We got Mark Aris. What's going on, boys and girls? Yeah, FD, front one by no derailleur cable. Hello, how are you? Margie. Margie, how are you? You're the mother of. Yes. Yeah. What are you thinking about this, Mom? What do you think about this adventure? Almost a little, almost a little, it's like the flight, I don't know. Okay. It's realistic. All right. I know it's going to be fun. We used to bike for a little time when we were younger, around Vermont and everything. Uh-huh. With four of you or just two of you or what? Uh, both. Oh, okay. But, uh, listen, I, I called the bike shop in Iceland. Oh, goody. And the, the guy was very nice, and he said that um, it's, it is 30 miles to get the bikes off from the airport. So I'm thinking they're going to put their bikes together and then um, take a shuttle, I guess, to the bike shop. He said what he would do is he would reserve some boxes for them. On the way back? Yeah, for the way back, so they can pack them up. Cool. So then all we're going to do is they can throw these boxes out when they're there. Yeah, yeah. Right? Yeah. yeah. Like that. Sounds good. And he said that he, said he did the whole ring... Who did? The bike shop guy. Oh. He did the whole ring road. Wow. In Iceland uh -huh. in 15 days. In 15 days. And he said that the winds prevail um, from... So do you have an itinerary all set up for these guys? It sounds like you're a pretty organized person. I'm really surprised that you got all of this information and these guys aren't didn't do any of it. I don't quite get it. Are you going to be a long ride with them, running behind, cooking up and doing that kind of stuff or what? I know it's you on my team. <laughs> A practice meal tonight. I see. I see. Outside in the backyard? Or? Oh, okay. All right. That sounds like a plan. All right. Let me get this the heck out of the way. We have Mrs. Nanook. Mrs. Not Mommy Nanook. Do you want to park it? Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> All right. So back at you. Hi. How are you? Hi. I'm Debbie Sanfora. Sanfora. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. How are you? Are you excited for them? 
Are you nervous? <laughs> are you, yes, yeah. you're nervous. And what, she was only nervous about the flight. What are you nervous about, Mom? Clip-on shoes, but they don't. So some straps or cages would um, make me feel better. Okay. Oh yeah, that's easy enough. That's easy enough. We could put. So you sounds like you've done some cycling in your day as well, huh? Oh, okay. So it doesn't go. You go. At, you go a lot of places fast. Uh huh. Uh huh. So it's your recommendation that they should have toe clips and straps on. Okay. You think you think Nick should have it as well? You think, I or what think do you think? Should have the straps. I do you think, think we should restrict them? These guys that are really not cyclists, Mom. I'm gonna do whatever They're you not think. Not cyclists. I don't say clip on. I they understand, but still, shoes. we're gonna be restricting. Hang on one second. Let's make sure everybody understands what's going on here. We are live right now, Mom. Just so you know. Everybody has got an opinion. Everybody knows what's best, except for. Let me put 60 pounds worth of stuff on the back of my bike, restrict my pedals, and not know how to ride a bike to begin with, and then crash. Okay. <laughs> if these if these guys were if these guys were cyclists and they were into this game and they were playing this game all the time, I would be all over. I have here's. Well, let me let me just throw this out at you, okay? I need a pair of snip stuffs so that I can move this, so that I can uh, clip this. Hang on one sec. Alright. Because neither one of these guys have really been on a bike since they've been before they drove, 15, right, was the last time they were on a bike, and now they're roughly 19, 20. We're going to put approximately 50 to 60 pounds over the back of this. So this is going to be a little, you know. Uh -huh. On occasion, there might be an right, so altercation where we might want to put our foot down. Yeah, yeah. And they're not used to this stuff. And they have this in there. And they, can't, they get this one out, but they got to go, you know what I mean? Uh -huh. okay. This is what you my concern would be. I'll do whatever you say, Mom. No, I but my I want them to they are not familiar with how to, you know, again, now I got a whole bunch of stuff on the back. Now you've got to be able to proficient to be able to catch your toe, flip it up, and then put it in. And then go a little bit, and then while you're moving, do that on the other side. If we should be doing that right now, the first time out of the barn in Reykjavik, Iceland, and then crash and burn, and now I got a bloody elbow. and Just a bloody elbow, right? I hope. I hope. <laughs> yeah, you know, I do not support your idea of toe clip and strap, for the record. Cool. We just saved ourselves $35, boys. Huh? I know we're on a budget. All right, I'm in. I'm in. All right. Moms, you guys are sticking around for the rest of this show, or what's the story? You're here for yeah. the whole story? No. Oh, you're leaving? Okay, what else yeah. you got for me, so kiddo? We're going to find out. Okay. And if it doesn't, then we'll take it home. Oh. Yeah. Well, here's the thing. Because they're talking about like their panniers. You're going to check your panniers. They hook together so you can carry them kind of like a suitcase or cool. something like that? Cool. Cool. No, that's the question. Oh, oh, it depends on the pannier. You know, I mean, it's not, it's, yeah, that's a very, you know, his is already sewn, to, uh, Nick's is already sewn together. It's, you know, goes right apart. Okay. Some of them come with a shoulder strap. Some of them are really, del I mean, you can spend more money on a set of panniers. Yeah. Than on you know yeah. the whole damn bike. Well, Wait, so are we saying if nothing else, you can tie them together? What's that? Is Nick packing? I don't know if Nick's packing that in the bike box. I just had him take those off because we're not going to put that in the bike box, and you know it, it's not going to go on there because a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff's got to come off of a bike in order to go into a bike box. Okay. And let me just I, I, here's just a quickie excuse me for just a half a second. Is there another knife behind you there? I'm looking for a knife. I had a knife earlier. Uh, now here's a here's 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 some bikes, okay? You with me? Here's how much room they're gonna have. All right. So we're gonna get that bike into this box. You with me, guys? Now this is this is from the manufacturer. Now we're not going to go all kinds of nutsy, cuckoo, crazy by wrapping up all the hand. You know, we if it gets a little scratch, so what? 
Yeah, that's okay. <laughs> All right. Um, but you can see how the manufacturer takes off the seat and puts that into there like that, right? This is this is a sweet bike for you. This is a really nice hybrid bike. And there it is. Okay. The wheel is off. The pedals, the the handlebar is off. The pedals are off. What these guys do, the manufacturers, is they put all of that pertinent stuff inside of this box. It takes us approximately. If you went balls to the wall, you'd probably take about 30 minutes for Makito to put one of these together, all the way, everything, including taking care of the garbage, including taking care of all of that stuff. But there's the bike. Now, we're going to play it a little bit different. We're going to make it so that everything of your bicycle is attached to one unit right there. We're going to tie wraps, tie wraps and plastic tie wraps. They work phenomenal. Put everything onto the bicycle. We're going to tape it in and we're going to show you all about this in a little bit. That way, God forbid, the box breaks. Now, did you look at how much room was in there when you were in there? He wanted to ask you, you know. Well, now it depends upon who you are and what kind of packing you are, all right? Now, you know, you want this to go in there? You know? Maybe down into there, there. You know, you're going to have to, maybe after we get our bikes all bundled up and packaged, we leave this part open. I am thinking, man. I am thinking. Because I'm sure you guys got some tape. Yeah. All right. I wouldn't, I would, I would try to use clear plastic packaging tape. Duct tape isn't going to stick too good to the cardboard. I mean, it'll work in a pinch, but you know. The other thing you got going for you is it's just one flight. It goes from here to the guy, to guy, to the plane, the plane, to the airport, right? Yeah. To the next airport, and then it comes off. So it's not going to be thrown through gorillas and all of the above like UPS would do, or this one or that one, where it changes multiple hands. So we're not in that critical of a shape. One thing that we are going to have to be concerned about is Homeland Security going in. Oh, yeah. They're going to go in that box. Yeah. So I don't know if I'd necessarily seal it really bad, you know? Um, I guarantee you they're going in there, yeah. period, yeah. and they're going to fish through your bags because they're going to see all kinds of stuff that they normally don't see. All right? All right, so again, you're going to throw, all right, here we go with that one. You ready? This, is, this one's really, this one's a tough one. Don't worry. Hang on. Hey guys, how are you? I gotta get where you are. Fred, you're right. <laughs> All right, now here we go. Real difficult, okay? This is my present to you guys one roll of packing tape. Yeah. This stuff is strong, man, okay? It's strong, all right? So we throw one of them in the box or tie wrap it. But obviously, this might come in real good and handy somewhere, yeah. all right? Really yeah, all right? So that's you're in charge of that. Uh, so we got to make sure we put that into a box and do whatever you got to do, all right? One roll of packing tape. That was easy. What else you got for me, Mom? I want to make you at ease because if you're at ease, they're going to have a much better time. Yeah, at this point we're going to open up your box when you get there. Yeah. Yeah. And you're going to put your bike together and then you're going to take the shuttle. Yes, yeah. with the bike. Yeah. So if I'm coming back, it's going to be a little bit more How do you carry a bike in a box? That's the question? And what? At the same time. At the same time of what? Well, because on the way back, they're going to stop at the bike shop, they're going to get a box, and they're going to have a bike. And they're still 30 miles away from the airport. Right, so you're going you're gonna, to you're gonna have $20 bills in your hand ready to go to the bike shop owner guy and say, hey, give me a ride for 40 bucks. Oh, okay. Good I mean, come on, use your head, guys. You know, a little cash goes a long way, man. A $20, $20 bill does a lot. 
sell That's your actually bike. a really good idea. Yeah. Okay. Sell Selling bike. the bike. <laughs> sell your bike. <laughs> that is an option. No. It is an option. No. Okay. Uh, well, it's not a bad idea. So, but I mean, carrying the bike when it's all done, I mean, it's not that bad. Oops, if I don't trip okay. over myself, okay. you know what I mean? All right. Good. I mean, I, am I going to hike 30 miles? What's that? I'm hoping that all their sh all their stuff is going in a box. Once you get off yeah. the plane. Well, again, I don't know how organized these guys are, but boy, if I was in that park, there would be two things. There would be this, and there would be my carry-on, and that's it. Yeah, yeah. Pack light. Light, light, light. They don't need clothes. I'm honest. Oh, but they do need their hair dryer. They are going to need that. I can see that. <laughs> I'm kidding, Mom. I'm kidding. Oh, boy. I had a water kicking around, I don't know. Oh, aren't you glad you guys tuned in? <laughs> That'll be about two days. <laughs> yeah, I'd say three weeks, but they'll be back in two days. <laughs> the only thing is it's going to take a little longer than two days to get the hell back. <laughs> Yeah, three weeks, I think. 20-something 20, 20 days they want. Yeah, so. It should be. It, yeah, well, if they, they're either going to hate each other or they're going to be loving each other at the end. You know, they're four guys, two brothers, two, two, a pair of twins and two other guys. So. They have, uh, like they have, they have no She's got to go check it out. She's like, let me see. <laughs> you can come out back. Take one of our cars, you guys can go out there. I don't have all day to be playing around. Let's get to work. You might make out. You might make money in this whole game. I mean, you know, you you, you only got two hundred bucks in the bike. I mean, you no, know, that, that was you know. I mean, you should be able to. I would think. I would think, you know, in that neighborhood. But see what happens. I mean, that's a that's a decision that that's a yeah, mo guys, moms. This is a decision that they can make when they're there. You know, it is an option. You know, I'm sure they'll be. They might even throw the damn thing off of the cliff and say, "The hell with this. I'm renting a car." Well, maybe not. <laughs> you know, but you know. I'm going to Amsterdam. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. I'm getting on the next flight out of here, you know? Everybody loves your story. I don't know. That's what I was going to ask. Do you want to stream from over there? Hey, you know, if you want. Well, you guys, you know, it's going to be tough for me to get your, for us to stream you on our thing. But if you guys want to broadcast who you guys are, meaning where you're going, if, if that's what you want to do, remember now, you're hitting thousands of people right this second, all right? And by the time this syndicates, by the time you leave, there's going to be probably 5,000 views, all right? So consequently, you know, if you put your name and your Instagram and your Facebook out there, be prepared. <laughs> that's all I'm saying, okay? It'd be a tremendous experience for you guys. But if you want to put it out there, we're going to write it down on the box. That was one of my suggestions, if you want to. Well, let's get on it. Let's go. What's the holdup? Write it on the box. Nice and big. Let me give you a pen. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I hope you guys are all ready. So it'll be interesting. Now, of course, any pictures that you place out, hashtag spell it the right way. All right. Don't mess it up. Everything that we do is Bike Man for You. Our Facebook, our Twitter, our Instagram, and every our YouTube. All right. That's going to work. Here you go. Who's writing? Right there. <sighs> All right. Here we go for that, folks. All right. You got Danny Panetta. He's going to watch you. Our buddy Jeremy Hogan says uh, he hopes Iceland has Uber.
Oh yeah, I hear you, Anthony. I hear you. I hear you. Be kind, Danny. You know what they used to do on the Russian front? The <laughs> Germans during the war. And the this is you, right? No, this is not okay. I'm with you. <laughs> Oh, the Mex boys got like too much, too much, got too much work to do. I ain't got time for BS. <laughs> How you doing over here? You looking good? You ready to get going fast and furious on these things? Again, I'm trying to keep this to an hour, right? And we already chewed up a half. Adam, what's going on? I don't know. That's a good question. We'll ask him. Tough, Christopher. <laughs> oh yeah, sure. All right, are we ready to get to work or what's the story? Have we figured this out? All right, the. Whose is this one? Nick, is this yours? Yes, that is mine. You're with him. <laughs> All right, Nick, here we go. I'm I'm, I don't think you I don't think you're gonna have to. I don't need to. I don't. I don't think you should. I think you should leave it on the ground. All right, here we go to do this. Yeah, and it's Tony Joe's inside. No, that one ain't going. It's going to be that size. This is an oversized box. It's that size box. Yeah, 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 yeah. No. Correct. Here, hold. I don't know. I did not ask anything in regards to that. I just didn't. Want, I didn't want to get. In, I'm, I'm too deep with this. With this. Yeah. For right this second, I'll break. Please, can you wait just a little bit for me? Can you wait Watch just us. a little Watch. bit until I'm done with these guys? Grab both like pads. Forty-five minutes. Squeeze them inward. Grab this little nub that would here. Help me because then I don't have the. Pop I'm not going to get. If I get customers, Sit. I'm not going to get taken off. Grab it here. I wanna, grab this you know what arm. I mean? I want to finish this up. Put it in there. there. Half hour. Check it. Maybe okay. we we'll get some lunch. If, what? Yeah, no, I figured. Uh, all right. Yeah, I'll catch you. I'm sorry. No, 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 that's fine. All right, yeah, Sam, I am. Pedals. Let's see if you remember what I taught you. Go. Talk. That was a rough day. Off. <laughs> what? I pedal was. <laughs> Because everyone's like, do this, do that, and I'm like, just yeah. let them go. <laughs> if they got it, they're fine. Uh, okay, here we go. What's Back again. Both pedals play? tighten in the that direction that the there, so you, you goes. Out there with the it goes this way. Both pedals oh, tighten that right. way. That one tightens this way. This one tightens that way. He's explaining Correct. It, but you know it. Because of that, this right. side is a left-hand oh, thread. Yeah. Yes. yeah? All right. Yeah. And it's indicated with an L on the back. Sam, I, you know, I don't mind teaching you stuff, but to over and over. Come on. You should have been on this, all right? Hash marks. Left. Left side. Tighten. Forward. With me? In order to go forward, both bicycles now, have to, both pedals have to key, tighten. Make sure oh, this that's guy That's how you're going to remember on. it, all right? Because okay. if you don't... Please, Sam, come on! Just, just make sure that, that guy you uh, got back on there, because that'll hold well, all yeah, the you stuff. Well, yeah, you don't, you don't need it. Yeah. Okay. You know, you're not going to need something this big. But, yeah, come on. I, you, know, yeah. you don't want to be carrying that. You're gonna need a wrench to do that. But you're going to need a pedal wrench, That's right? You got some bike. sort of a pedal wrench? And then, uh, 
15 millimeter. I don't know if he was expecting me to explain it. A 15, they, mil a fi you know, a 15 millimeter right open end like that will, will work. Oh, I almost forgot what You know, you're going to want something thing. with a little bit of leverage, you know? When, you, when you're free counting on you two yeah. as being the, uh, the equipment guys, because I'm right sure now Sam in, uh, failed his first question. All right? I'm sure it's in the uh, lowest gear. Put on I'll a spot smut on the spot. All right. Oh, that, because if it's okay, so now I have down, my pedals off. It sticks out. A box will smash it. Yeah. Up, Remember, and then, and then you'll you be screwed be for if you don't put the right day. pedal on the left, on the left okay. side, so, on the right side. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Lowest gear. Okay. Lowest gear. All right. That's that. Pack it up. Pedals. Now, like we talked about before. Okay. Pedals. We're gonna put them onto the bicycle. The best place that I've like found this. to put them is going to be right in this rear wheel. Well, what about a Well, yeah. I stick them there. Bart sticks them in the uh, wheel. And I'm going to tie wrap them right on. And we're going to give you... You uh, guys are going to have a knife with things. you, I would hope, okay. right? Awesome. Yeah, yeah well, so uh, you're going to be safe. Don't worry. Whoops, I back, which did not. Today's a good day when we're getting everything together. I, I, dude, <laughs> you guys have to be, like, panicking. You're like, oh, shit, uh, we got this? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Surprisingly, I don't know. It's, our moms are doing the pancakes. Really? Like, my dear, I, I know don't I'm have ready. their bicycle well, my here. Dad, my dad I was can't tell. Years, so oh, okay. He checked everything. Oh. Oh. I, I, and um, no I don't know. If their yeah, seat's like, up a little bit, I can't mom, remember, you know? I, 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 I mean, what, little, you know, oh, yeah. whatever it takes, more my dear. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Got that one. Yeah, you can interrupt me two minutes. Well, you're all part of the same interruption, so go ahead. Do we want to leave the bag on there, or do we not want to leave the bag? What would be... Uh, I think it's probably in that box again, right over here. So, probably never probably came out. I would probably throw that in your carry-on, okay. or, or you can, or you know, Try we could zip it. Probably. Oh, you know what? Yeah, zip tie it right, right in there. Okay. How is this? All right. This I'll probably put you with me. That way they're not coming out. Yeah. If the box, God forbid, the box opens up, right? All right. Next thing, we got to get the, we got to disconnect. And do this. Sam, I'm not going to undo it all the way. I'm just undoing the quick release, okay? Okay. With me? Same thing back here. Now, here comes another one, all right? A little quickie, all right, gentlemen? Remember, we did not move anything. We did not use any wrench or anything, but I want to have more space when I start to deal with this handlebar to be able to put it around. I'm just going to pull this Yeah, that's easy. easy. Piece of cake, man. Now I'm going to have a lot more room when I don't move my handlebar. Mm -hmm. Okay, the next item that's going to come off of this thing is going to be my front wheel. I've got my brake undone. Try number two. If you redeemed yourself from the last time. Taking them off is always easy. You got, you got it, Sam. I am. Let's do it. Come on, Sam. Yeah. 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 <laughs> you guys are familiar with how quick releases work, right? Yes. One is one of these things falling off, you know? Yeah. All right. Is it going to come out now? Is it going to drop out or no? Not enough yet. All right. Keep going. Yeah. You can use that. All right. Yay. Da, 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 da. All right. Now, the quick release on here. Sometimes they leave them on, sometimes you don't, okay? In this case, I'm going to leave it on, I think, because it's pretty, it's pretty tight on there. Let me see if we can get that off. So where are... Are, are you taking the quick releases off? Oh, you I are. You did. I think, yeah, I think I got it, too. Yeah, because I was going to zip-tie it with the... Yep, zip-tie it all. ...pedals here, so it's all in one spot. Now, BMX Boy has a totally different technique, but he's still putting everything on the bike. Keep everything right. with the bike. You leave the stuff floating around out there in the middle of the box, it's going to fly out, I guarantee you. All right, now that's going to be much easier for you. All right. Again, tie wrap. What's that? I didn't make myself clear. Yeah. Everything is going on the bike. 
Period. There's no other box. Tie wrap is your body, okay? I'm going to take my clip. I'm going to put it on here. I'm going to tie wrap it on there. There isn't going to be any small parts to answer the question because it's all going to get tied on to here. If I threw this in one of them little parts boxes, you know, the chances of it coming out of there, out of maybe the, who knows? But that ain't coming off of there now. The reason I take that quick release off too is I'm going to get a little extra room here. All right, it's and it, we need every little inch to get this thing out of here. All right, next is going to be the handlebars. You got to come all out of the stem. All right, here we go to do this. Allen key, six millimeter, right? His is different. Lo and behold, it's moving. I'll be darned, right? Now, I can't get it out. Do you see what's going on? My cable is hitting. I can't unhook here. I could unhook here if I had to. Or I can undo that. Oh, I don't unhook it from here. I can do that too. That way you'd never have to adjust it. But again, this is a little different. This is, you're going to be able to adjust your brake accordingly. Okay. You follow where I'm getting at? Yeah. So, what can I do? I can do two things. I can undo it off of here if you really wanted to. I think that might be a little bit more difficult. You got to line up the two little slots with everything, right? Pull this out, come through here. Is there an easier way? Undoing that Allen bolt right there. Oh, just the Allen bolt will do it? Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's the way to go. I think that's the way to go too instead of you try you guys trying to mess around with this. So we're going to go to here, yeah. all right? Uh, uh, nope, five <laughs> millimeter. Now you see how it's got that little end on there? I'm going to undo it all the way so I can finagle that on and then I'm going to screw this back down again, all right? Mm -hmm. So I don't lose that. You lose that bolt, you're really, you're definitely screwed. You're riding 30 miles to the bike shop without a front brake. All right, now my handlebars are going to come off. What's that? It's actually a, it, uh, it's a dust, it's a date, a joke, but whatever. All right, so now here's what we're going to do. We're going to tighten this up accordingly, right? You understand how this works, right? This is a wedge action. See that, right? When I tighten this up, it makes that wedge, right? Yeah. Right? If, if, if by happenstance, when you're Get the handlebar out, and this is coming up. Take a good handlebar and smack that down. That way, it lines it all in. Yeah. That happens all the time on old bikes. Teaching you guys. I'm not done yet. Yeah, I can tune them. There's the magical moment right there, folks. Look at that. It actually made it. All he's got to do is a small modification where the rack is going. I'm going to go here, okay? I got to because we need to be able to move that. I got to be able to move that. Whoops. I got to be able to do that, all right? All right, now next. This is supposed to go turned all the way around, but now I can't get that all the way around, can I? All right. Now listen, guys, all right? This is. I'm trying to make it as easy and simple instead of undoing that 10 millimeter bolt, all right? It's going to go now. All right. So then, when you get out, bend it back. All right. Yeah, that's good. That makes sense. Simple. Yeah, that's cool. Right. Bend it back into position. So now I'm all the way backwards. We're moving. I need somebody to hold this. Did you put a fork? Did you put a fork holder in that? I would put one in there. I need one too. Uh, no. Was your, uh, plastic stuff? I got one for me. I need one of these. Uh, save these. Save these. Okay. Hey, you want one of them too?
This is going to help out a lot, all right, guys? This will help us to keep our fork together and whatnot. It's not an absolute necessity, but you know what I mean? It'll help it from going through the box. This kind of helps. All right, now, here we go. The wheel is going to get motivated right in between here, but we got to co coordinate up, weave it in between that crank arm, okay? That's a damn good idea. Everybody get out of the way for half a second, all right? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come in here with that wheel, and I'm going to spin that baby right around. Pump's got to go. Don't let go of that. Double check, triple check, a quadruple check yourselves on this stuff, boys. That's going to be pretty good. All right, hold that. Right there, right there. That's good. Now they're gonna want, they're gonna want, they're gonna want um, the air out of the tires, aren't they? I'm assuming. Yeah, he just emptied the air out of the other one. What's that? Did you let air out of yours, Mark? Yep, I did. Okay. Yeah, you got it right there. Slap it on there nice and tight. I get going the other way. You see it? It's got little groovies on there. It's getting exciting now. Hey, we got rid of moms, huh? That was it. They're scared to death of death. They are scared to death. Yeah, I'm on video for like an hour left. Yeah, I made sure I made sure they had all the right supplies. Yeah. Well, I, I, you know what? I think the communication is going to be a key to keep, to keep your moms at least a little bit. You know, communication. I can't explain. I can't emphasize that enough. All right. So now I need some place to put this. Right. This is why we unloose. Fork's got to be turned around in order to get in the, in the, in the box, all right? Yeah. So now, I like this spot right in here. Now, I, you see where I'm at here? Where's some more tire? A couple of wraps. Position in a little bit better position. Yeah, maybe Turn that around. Yeah. I do that all the time. You only make that right now with movies on both sides. But that ain't looking too bad. Now let's pop out that seat. Let's go. Drag it out of here. I undid it. Pull. Twist and pull. Alright, now we got to figure out where we're going to put our seat. I think it's going to make it. Let's just have a quick double check. And where, how come yours isn't in the box yet? Move your stuff out of the way. No, you can. You're alright there. Alright, let's see what happens. Grab a hold of that on the back side. I got the front side right off the rack. Yeah, there you go. Right in there. Boom. Let's go. Let's see what happens. Let's give it a little test fit. A little test fit. Hot oh, yeah. damn, boys. Yeah. Huh? Perfect. Hot yeah. damn. All right. We're moving. All right. No, you're not. We're going to tie wrap it all on there. Okay, now it's your turn. I want this, however you want to do this, okay, to get into there. And I want it all tie wrapped to that. Looks like a glove. Now, mm. listen. 
these guys here okay tie wraps are going to be your friend maybe you might want to tie wrap some of these on the frame somewhere or something good. you know nah, what i mean same. these could come in a lot of handy all right yeah. maybe you with me yeah, you a little farther up mr and mrs camp mr camper nah. pull that i'm without a tribe no oh, <laughs> i ride you. road mtv Merry BMX. Christmas. all right now next you're on top of that. There you go. Here's some tie wraps, whatever you need. Tie wrap that. Get this bag off of there. Tie wrap that in there. Take your pump. Tie wrap that on here. And then where's all the rest of your junk that you got? This is all his junk, right? Sam's junk? Is that the stuff that we're supposed to get in the bag, in the box? Yeah, yeah. Is that the, right? So we got to start figuring out what you're going to do about that. Okay. Hey, Sam, how about we... Maybe right underneath here. Is that a spot maybe right there? Somebody's right in here? Be really disappointed when yeah, they what do you think, huh? That work, right? Yeah. They think that they're too giants. Bad. What do you think? <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> brand new boxes, too. Yeah. What do you got? Four? They're going to be like, we got to Is that your number? That's your number yeah. six, ain't it? Take yeah, all right. Pop them over here. Um, yeah, take the box off of there. I'll cut that piece this? of cardboard off of there. I went through a lot of time to steal these. You're not doing anything here. Help your buddy. I gotta check in on my fans. Yeah, you do. <laughs> what do they got for us, Fred? Uh, Anything you got? Anything good out there, Fred? Troll's gonna eat them all. What's that? Trolls are gonna eat them all. Uh, isn't that the that is where our trolls come from, isn't it? Iceland? Elves. 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 Elf culture. So what are you guys looking for? A couple of female elves? Is that it, maybe? Huh? Little elfettes? Half breed elves. <laughs> Oh, that was bad. <laughs> That's terrible. That was terrible. Get your mind out of the gutters. Watch, this is, this is going to be good. Now, I wouldn't go nuts right off the bat, all right? I mean, you might, you still want, you, you don't have any other stuff to be putting in here yet? Are you sure? All right. Oh, yeah. How about you bring it on home, huh? Alan C's in the house. You know where Alan C's from, boys? Thailand. Now, if there's anybody from Iceland that's watching, if this syndicates, and if there's anybody from Iceland, these boys are leaving tomorrow. They're going to be there on Saturday, Sunday. Be looking for these four American clowns. I mean, nice guys that are going to be riding down the street. Check them out. They might even have a Bike Man For You shirt on. And I guarantee you, if you stop and you see them, they're going to give you a personalized Bike Man For You sticker. You guys are going to give them stickers, right? hero <laughs> 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 Now, any of you guys out there, if you need to, I don't know how many you think. Give me a couple of those. There's a couple. Oh, if you guys meet any of our fans in Iceland, I will have a canary. <laughs> All right, here you got various different spots you can put them. All right, so that way you got them at hand at any t any specific time. All right, please, guys, don't be stickers. Don't sticker slap responsibly. A chicken salad on an onion roll. 
You know, I don't, I don't, I did, I gave him a bolo. Uh, all right, are we good to go? What else you got for me? Look at that, huh? Not bad. All right, this is, if you can get this on the underneath side. Now, this is not, you know, where, where's your tie wrap? You got any more? That off. Thank you, and see in 20? All right, thanks, bye. Do you need any more tie wraps, you're thinking? Take two. That's a little better spot. Give me one right here diagonally across that. Oh, okay. Tie wraps are cheap, boys. Don't be cheap, okay? Use them. Go. Now give me another one diagonally or right around that. You gotta think for the worst. Just, you know, these guys are gonna beat the crap out of your body. There you go. Nah, doesn't that look a little better? A little more secure? You're gonna make it, Nick. Oh, Sam. I tell you, you're gonna make it. I think you're gonna be alright. Now, I wouldn't necessarily go like this, God forbid, the compression factor, right? This way is gonna be a better. Uh, we should also zip tie these to the bike. Absolutely. Yeah. Everything. Absolutely, yeah. Everything, okay? No small parts boxes. Exactly. None of that crap. So keep going. If you're going to continue to do all of this other crap, keep on going, Sam I am. Tie it in there. Tie it in there. She lived a full... This is Bo passed away. Oh, yeah. How old was she? Nice. She had to be. But she was saying that Kathy was saying that in the past, you know, for me, she's like, what can we do for you? Uh, she, she wanted to go. She wanted to go. So it's a blessing. Rest in peace, Mrs. Bo. D A N I E L Q U A 1 7. Oh, you're on the bottom. L E L A N D Q U A. Both of them. Let's go. Follow them up Instagram. There it is. When the show comes off, I'm going to follow these boys. I got to. I got to. <laughs> What's that? All right. All right. Netherlands checking us out. Ron Morell, how about you? Bring it on home. Alexander Santiago, good job. It's happening. Soundtrack of our lives is in the house. I didn't expect to see you today. How are you? How are you? <laughs> Tony wishes she was going. I do. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta have days we're gonna kill each other, but you know, one country, you gonna have a ball. And I know how much fun you're gonna have. Uh, I'm admirous of you guys. Uh, I think it's gonna be great. I think it's I gonna be fun. I just kept tripping a car with Kathy back from Texas. Yeah, the car, in a car. That's a in little a car, different but story. The car breaking down. That's Greetings from Eastern Canada. How did you get some Bike Man for You stickers? Really simple and easy to get your own Bike Man for You stickers. Self addressed stamp envelope right to the shop. We'll load them up, baby. It's real simple. Our address is on the web. You can go over to our website, bikemanforyou.com. About us or contact us gives you our snail mail address. Boom! Self-addressed stamp envelope. Put your address on there. Put that. You guys know how to do it, I think. We've showed you a couple of times. By all means, we'll get you some. And because you're a nice guy, and if you tell them you saw the Nanook, I mean the Iceland guys. <laughs> I'm not supposed to say that. No, it's not politically correct, according to the producers. Oh, really? Our producers say that, you know, it's like, you know, Nanook was an Eskimo. They're going yeah. to Iceland. There's no Eskimos in Iceland. 
Okay. What do you say so. that we geographically challenged? Yeah, you? you know, I was, you know, I don't know, whatever, but whatever. You look at that video we saw, that guy was unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, you should see that Nook guy. Very, very uh, industrious. Yeah, I, I, I figured, you know, that's a compliment calling him. And that, that Nook was a tough guy, man. <laughs> Did we did Bart tell you that we're not allowed to? No, no. But I mean the video we saw some years ago. It was about this. You know, the in, in, in the Arctic Circle. Was he Alaska? Antarctica? They were somewhere up in the Arctic Circle. Oh my God! And he, he just he was wrestling that seal for hours, man. He got it though. It's like like sixty below, and the mother shows up with a baby on the back. <laughs> Smiling like this is frozen. All right. <laughs> Wiggy. We got Wiggles in the house. What are you doing? Are you a good boy? Are you a good boy? Yes, you are. Yeah. Excuse me, you all that. Give me a little fur. Huh? That a boy. What? Go on this side. This, uh, this bag right here. So, um, so what gonna, are you going to do? We're going to move this to over there. because. Oh, okay. I agree with that. Here. I agree. With that. So what do you need? Oh, you need a pair of dikes. Now, with these tie wraps, you know, they're really handy. But please don't litter. Throw them in the garbage can, all right? Let's, uh, you know, whatever. Let's leave it better than when we left. Please, okay? Let's not give Americans a stupid name, all right? So many places I've been all right, around the world, Americans do not necessarily have the best of reputations, all right? Remember that. It all comes down to respect. So please, especially when you're representing the Bike Man for you worldwide, the Bike Man for you team, all right? Are we done yet? Are we ready for the group photo? Are we sending you off? Are we signing off yet? What's that? All right. You're almost there. That wasn't too bad. Did we get it within an hour, BMX boy? Did we do it in an hour? Yeah. Look at that, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Nice. We're damn. That's what I budgeted. That's what we had. Oh yeah, baby. All right, now, what, you, what just happened to you guys right now, remember that. Don't let that happen again to you. I'll get you set. It is. What did you do? Did you pull it tight to, to, to remove it? Where's your knife? Take your knife. And if you play like, there it is. Oh, yeah, I wouldn't. Yeah. See what I mean? Yeah. You would have never found it. So you use your knife like a little razor. Now, when you start to get it like that, at least you got it started. Don't, be a, don't worry about wasting a little bit of tape. It ain't, it ain't the end of the world, okay? You know what I mean? Now, tape it like that. You know what I mean? Now you're never going to lose the end again. So when you get done, right, you're going to go over here like that. You're going to do that like that. When you cut it, hold this, all right? That way you can do that, right? You follow me? Yes, I am. <laughs> All right. Don't let go of that, right? Then it can come back around. Or if you're going again, right, you're going to go again. Again, how you hold it is all what it's about, all right? Whatever, all right? And when you hand it to the guy, make sure you screw up the end for him so that way he's got to cut it. They get pissed off, but it doesn't happen again where that happens. You know what I mean? In case of emergency. <laughs> See what Mum said, it's only a four hour flight? Six, yes, uh, five. Uh, six. Four, six. There's a four hour time difference. Yeah. And uh, you're four hours six. ahead of us, right? Yeah, yeah. Yes. Oh, cool. Yeah. So it's a five or six hour flight, I guess. Okay, that's still. Oh, that's what I said on ticket six hours. Yeah. That's not okay. bad. It's not bad at all. It's uh, also like pretty cheap. So. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, good. Like, relative to what it could be. <laughs> awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. What school, what college you guys go to? I go to the University of New Hampshire. Oh, cool. What yeah. year are you in? Uh, I'm going to my sophomore year. Do you know Zach Devonsky? Yes, I know Zach Devonsky. Yeah. I haven't seen him out there, but I know that he went to my high school. And then yeah. you're going to do sophomore year, Gina Leonard? 
call Redhead from Massachusetts? I do not. It's okay. You might meet her. Maybe I'll meet her. I'm from Massachusetts. I know she's she's transferred there. She's a sophomore now. Yeah, sophomore now. From she went to Tampa for a year. Oh, okay. Yeah. And does your brother go there too? Yeah, yeah Leona goes there also. Oh, cool. You like it? Yes. Son of us in the house. Son of a like special live broadcast went well. What do you think? What's your what's your oh, cool. yeah. right. what do you yeah, think there? Huh? Oh, nice. What do you think? You think nice. they're gonna be all right? You think they're gonna make it? What do you think they're gonna? What do you think? Their bikes break. They're gonna be fine. You think they're gonna be able to get their bikes up and running? You think so? It's thirty miles away. Only one will survive. All right. I'm 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 I'm. I'm I am very optimistic for these guys, and I'm hoping that they have a good job. Good job. All right, here we go. We're going to sign them off, get some lunch going. Did somebody order it already, right? All right. You got me what, Mandarin chicken salad, no Mandarin? Oh, all right. Getting ready for lunch. Yeah, yep. Uh, he wants to go with it. He needs, he needs, I had him go to some sheep herding last year um, in, in Manorville. I'm gonna get back and need something to move more. Uh -oh. <laughs> hold it down. Oh, you see, they got these guys need the lesson. You get, oh, teach them, teach them the lesson. The tape won't hold it. Get it on there we quick. left it. We left it. it. Teach them, teach them the technique. Will you next show them how to do it, huh? Nick certified. Nick's tape certified. When you come back, Nick, we're gonna we got a job for you. All right. All right. All right. Just tape it up. That's it. We got you know, <laughs> Packages are done for today, but yeah, we pack every day. I'll retape them. The online. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, have a, I have a. I have a. I have a specific tape dispenser. Free of charge. I just tape everything. There you Beautiful. go. Hello, fine customers. Tape against the walls. All right. So again, today's show is brought to you by EVT Efficient Velo Tools. Efficient, efficient Velo Tools making the third arm repair stand, the EVT three-in-one inflator, and of course our medieval pedal wrench. If you are a professional bicycle shop, you've got to have one of these. This was worth every penny. It's worth its weight in gold. Yeah, I know it's a lot of money, but you know what? The best costs. And that is the best. That is, that is the best, by far, the, the finest pedal wrench on the planet. We used to struggle with uh, stuck pedals constantly, but now... Never again. No, you just jump on that thing. It's done. Boom, now, I'm wondering, by me, did you show the guys the Wiggles Wagon has an option for the four of them? Yeah, I think so. I think maybe we could put pontoons on it and just send it off a Montauk and just let them know. <laughs> yeah, six... Six-hour flight turns into, what, a four-day cruise? Six, uh, six months. A little bit more, maybe. Six months. Yeah. Three-hour tour. Sounds like Gilligan Island. Yeah. Four friends saddle. All right. Get some money. Um, playback was interrupted. Uh-oh. We had a problem, Bubba. Fresh. Alan C is on her. Yeah. Yeah. Why? No, no, no. Just been talking on I can't get it to come back. Alright, so we're on the plane. Let's go. Come on. Alright. Alright, so are we good to go? <laughs> Antonio, are you out there? Bubba? What's up? Are you got a stream or no yeah, stream? I'm streaming. I'm good. You're good on your end? I'm not. We're dead. The site can't be reached. Why is that? You got no internet out here, Bob. What's up with that? Gave up on what thing? Oh. All right, so we're good to go, hey? Yeah. All right. Let's get a photo.
Antonio, you want to come out here and give us a picture of the, Nano, uh, the, uh, the Iceland boys? Set it, in, set it in neutral and just come out and take a picture. Uh, we got Washington, D.C. in the house. Hello, you got the bike, man. What time did you guys flight leave? 2.10. Yeah, tomorrow. In the morning? Uh, no, at night. At night? At night. Yeah. All right, here you go, bub. That was to tell me my student loan is expired. All right, guys, come on, get in here. Real nice and tight, right in here. Make sure you get the back of the, the Instagram. You right there. Kind of leave a little, if you can leave just a hair. I'm going to stand right here. You're going to come closer to me. Okay. Give me right in here, Nikki. Okay. Sam, I am right there. <laughs> get in tight. Get in tight. Energy, guys. Energy. Yeah! I look like I just got stung by a bee. That's right. <laughs> all right. You got all your gear. You got all your stuff. Your Dominus. I wish you guys the best of luck. Right? Thank Seriously. You. And you guys can do it. You're going to have a lot of fun. Uh, be safe. Please be safe. Okay? Safety is number one. Right? If you think something's going to go south, it probably is. So don't let it happen. You know what I mean? All right. All right. I'll give you a hand putting your stuff in the car. Or what's the story? Here, why am I doing that? Yeah, what do I, I look like? A valet? Like <laughs> <laughs> All right. One there and one there. Grab that. There you go. There you go. There you go. That's a little backwards, but that's all right. You're welcome, guys. Have fun. Enjoy. Ride safe. Uh, yeah, make sure. All right. I'm going to be following you guys ASAP, uh, and we're going to put your reins on our Instagram. So see you later. Oh, there we are. We're back up and running on here. All right, son of a... Here we go to the... Oh, boy. Tony Joe's going to get that, I hope. Yeah, good. All right, so that's concluding our today's live broadcast, our live episode, our special episode brought to you by EVT, Fish and Bella Tools, and BikeManForYou.com. Don't forget to rate, comment, and or subscribe. Come over to our Facebook, our Instagram, and our Twitter for all of the latest and exciting stuff from the Iceland crew. Should be good. Don't forget, we are live each and every Saturday, 10 a.m. New York time. So tune in next week, or this coming up week on Saturday. It's only two days away. Yeah. More fun at the Bike Man for You. Remember, guys, to be kind to one another. Love one another. And above all, respect one another. If you see something, you know what to do. Say something. The war on terror is never going to end, so let's all do our part. Love you guys. Thanks so much for tuning in. Let's have a little prayer for our boys to Iceland tomorrow, all right? I hope they have a good trip. Thanks again for tuning in, guys. I want you to have fun, and I want you to never fear. The bike man for you is here. Da, 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 da. All right. That was a good show. That was a good quickie. A good quickie.